against Mikey Gomez, who's the smaller, shorter of the fighters, with a pro record of three to one. You can yeah. see that uh, Mikey Gomez has a much longer reach. So this is going to be an interesting fight. What do you think? It might be a big step up for Mikey. Uh, I'm not sure if this is going to be a good matchup. Ooh, that was a groin shot. <laughs> that was uh, that was right, almost right on the scalp. Uh, but uh, we'll see how Mikey does. Beautiful low kick that stung him. You see that? With the mm -hmm. short part of yep. his shin. Yep. Um, Those shin kicks can be devastating. Yeah, as you yeah. Know. that's right. You need to start blocking that. But shin. yeah, that's a beautiful leg check. That hurt both people's shins, both guys. So that means that uh, now Mikey's gonna kind of slow down his low kicks a little bit. When blocked properly, those shin kicks can uh, hurt both fighters. Yes, definitely, definitely. You notice these fighters pick up their leg to block a shin kick, and they meet a shin with a shin. That's right. You do less damage. Ooh, Good combination. Nice. Start throwing your knees, Mikey. These fighters are allowed to clinch for up to five seconds. Yeah. And then they're going to get broken up by the ref. Right hand lead. Bobby said right hand lead. So he's going to try to get him with the right hand lead now. He's going to do exactly what Bobby says. Huh? You know? Yeah. See? Right hand lead. He doesn't come in with a jab, but with the right hand. He needs to start blocking the low kicks, or he's going to be. He's not going to last the whole round. Yeah. Those low kicks can take you out. Ooh. Those need to be blocked, because that will. That will hurt. We've seen many fighters go down just from shin kicks to the thigh, and uh, some of your fights, Stefan, have uh, been great examples of how shin kicks to the thigh can end a fight. Yeah, it's good if you do it to the other, but if they do it to you, it's not so good. That's and, right. Uh, you we've definitely want to block it. We've seen you win several Shindo Kumite bouts, uh, Stefan Butenbeek, by uh, raising grapefruit, grapefruit sized welts on your opponent's thighs. Yeah, I was fortunate. Uh, and skilled. Skill too. Hopefully, uh, you, you just want to have a good day. You know, you just want to have uh, good timing that day and and uh, kick him right in the leg. Audience definitely getting into this Shinoku Mate bout. Yeah. Very exciting. Mikey's holding his own right now. Um, he needs to truly start blocking that with his shin. Ooh, that's another one that's in the cup. Mikey's using up a lot of energy. See, uh, Thiago Pitbull Arujo is getting a little bit more relaxed. There you go. Hope he doesn't burn himself out. <laughs> Seem to have had a little audio problem, and uh, yeah, yeah, I think I'm back. We have Stefan Bouton back. Oh, on the bell, on the bell. <laughs> 